Hello students, today we will do chapter 6, Introduction to JavaScript. In this chapter, we will do program of JavaScript. You can open page number 128 in the lab. In the lab, number 1 question you can see, write a JavaScript code to print your name residential address and telephone number and display them on separate lines so we have to create a javascript program to display your name and residential address and telephone number on separate lines but your name address and telephone number you have to input in the beginning so your program need to tell you enter your name enter your address and enter your telephone number so after entering your name address and telephone number that name address and telephone number have to come on separate lines so we will create the program so let's go to notepad because we need to type the javascript code in notepad we will click on start we will type notepad You can see Notepad option. Click here. Notepad is opened. Now start typing the code. First, you write doc type, leave a space, write HTML, then HTML tag, then body tag, then script tag. with language attribute value will be javascript leave a space use type attribute value will be equal text slash javascript double quotation angular bracket enter now you need to take three variables Take var, leave a space, take name variable, for name I am taking shortly n, comma, then for residential address I am taking r, insert, comma, for telephone number I am taking t, so n for name, r for residential address and t for telephone number I am taking three variables, enter. Now I'm going to use n variable and assign with the prompt box P R O M P T prompt bracket start write enter your name double quotation bracket close now you can use R variable assign a prompt box prompt bracket start right enter your residential address then you can use t variable right prompt bracket start enter your telephone number okay so this three input we have already completed this n r and t so prompt means that input box so prompt when we use prompt that means our input box will come to enter after entering it will go to the variable which is assigned with the prompt so n we have assigned with name R we have assigned with residential address T we have assigned with telephone number now we will display name residential address and telephone number on separate lines so for displaying we have to use document.write so document.write statement is used to write text on the screen or you can say display text on the screen so we will type here document.write 
then bracket start you can use n variable n for the name then you can use on plus sign this is called concatenation we are going to use br tag here in document outright you can use br tag or any kind of tag of html but remember you need to use this plus sign in between the variable and tag this plus sign is called combining this variable and tag this merging the variable and uh, tag actually this by this uh, plus sign this is called concatenation so again plus concatenation the next r variable r for residential address again plus again one more break because separate line that's why break br tag will give the line break okay so next plus t variable for telephone number okay enter so i'm going to tell something about uh, document dot right this statement n n will display the name then line break because i have to come on separate lines then r next line in separate line will come r r means residential address then again one line break we'll go to the next line then t t means telephone number so document dot right will display these strings which is already we have written within the bracket of document dot right now we can finish our program so for finishing the program you need to close the script tag the next body tag the next html tag so we have finished our program now we need to save the program for that file save or save as anyone we can, we can also press our control plus s for saving okay so this is save as dialog box so type your file name i'm going to give here this is a javascript program so i'm going to write here javascript or simply you can write any kind of name whatever you want i'm writing a shortly js program okay js program dot html i'm writing here js program js program is the name and dot html is required it's an in each and every program of javascript okay so after typing the name you can save anyway like desktop documents anywhere you can save i'm going to save on desktop so i clicked desktop and i saved so our program is saved now we will check so let's check the program so this is our file okay so our file is ready now we will open and we will check let's double click here so this is the prompt so click here allow block contents this is actually uh, this prompt comes when you use internet explorer okay so to allow just click here and allow block contents then yes now you see this is the prompt box the first one this one you can see enter your name you can see here this is the box so you can enter any name so i'm typing here arun okay so okay the next enter your you can see here enter your residential address i'm typing here guwahati okay the next mobile number means telephone number anyone just i'm typing any number okay just i simply i type number okay now you can see arun name guwahati address then telephone number this way you can create the program now let's open again we will close this this is the file we will open again but this time we will not open using internet explorer let's open in google chrome so right click here you can open open with then google chrome so let's open in google chrome and you can check the same program you can open in google chrome also 
if you want to open this program in google chrome firefox internet explorer or any kind of browser you can use for opening so let's do in google chrome once means we have already completed just we will see the output will come or not okay so we will enter here a name so this time i'm typing simply smita okay so smita does i'm typing here smita does okay address i'm writing here jorhat assam okay now i'm typing the mobile number okay i'm typing the mobile number simply this is not number of anyone i'm just typing on the digit to display only so okay now you can see here i'm going to zoom you see so this is the output you can see here smita name jorhat address and telephone number so these three comes in separate lines you can see once again if you want to learn how to create javascript program to display your name address and telephone number on separate lines so this is the answer by watching this video you can learn how to create javascript program so students you can practice in your computer by watching this video and uh, please like the video and uh, subscribe the channel thank you